All right, and welcome back, guys. So they just released the season two trailer for uh, Cold War, and I'm really, really hyped for this because, uh, yeah, there's not a ton of content to do in Cold War. Uh, we've kind of done a lot of this stuff in Firebase. He's still a little bit of fun to have there, but uh, definitely looking for some new content. The main thing I'm most looking forward to is new weapons to grind camos on, level up, and get some progression on stuff like that. So I'm not going to waste too much of your time. Let's go ahead, start watching this, see what we can point out, and see if we can get any information on some of the newer weapons. Stitch, the rats are here. Adler's secure and headed to you at Verdansk. Good. Make them believe we care about the Nova Sig so That right there is a new weapon. Uh, definitely an SMG. I don't see that being anything else. Looks pretty much exactly like the, uh, the Caparis from Black Ops 1, which was kind of a unique, kind of a little out there SMG. Uh, it was the final one you unlocked. You had to buy every other SMG in that category to get the Caparis. Uh, had a pretty insane rate of fire, but uh, it was kind of outclassed by all the other SMGs. It wasn't the best thing ever. Uh, the main thing it was used for in Black Ops 1 was it's a Kimbo mode. That was really kind of, if you're using the Caparis, you're probably using it with the dual wield, uh, which we don't have any dual wield primaries in this game. So, and I don't think that they're going to introduce it with this. Potentially, maybe they do, but I, I doubt it. But yeah, so that's one new weapon confirmed here that we'll be getting. It's the Caparis. We don't know if it's going to be the day the season launches or if it's going to be, you know, a kind of a mid-season weapon. Hopefully, hopefully we get probably two or three new things right on the bat when uh, season goes live. So new SMG, which is a little weird because as you know, we have only gotten three new weapons so far. We've got an AR, an SMG, and a shotgun. And it looks like right off the bat, they're adding another SMG. I would love to see a new LMG, a new sniper, uh, probably not a new shotgun because we already have one of those, but you know, something we haven't seen yet. A new pistol, dude, I'd love like a Deagle. I know there was like a Deagle of sorts in the campaign. Uh, so I kind of want to see these less loved categories get some new weapons, dude. Because right now, I mean, there's only three pistols, there's only three snipers and three LMGs. Uh, and definitely a prime category for getting a DLC weapon for. Not the SMGs, which, what do we have? Six SMGs before the launch of this, so now we have seven SMGs. But I mean, hey, I'll take it. Something to grind, uh, something to grind gold on. Oh, and that's a crossbow, which is actually really freaking cool. So right, right off the bat, that's something completely new. Uh, probably gonna be in the special weapon category with the thumper. Uh, which you know is really freaking cool because you know what that means if this is a special weapon in the same class of the thumper is that means you no longer need to get the thumper gold to get dm ultra you don't need it to get dark aether you don't need any of that you can do the crossbow instead and it will kind of take the uh the thing you need to do in that category and a lot of people have been complaining about the thumper the long shots with it the three kills without dying the double kills a lot of complaints with that this will make it so you can completely skip doing the thumper to get dm ultra which is awesome and it's a category that is definitely new i'm definitely going to be kind of excited about that and i can't wait to use it we'll see how good it is i know that the the crossbow in call of duty especially in trailer games can be a little uh a little insane sometimes we'll just have to see exactly how it plays out in this game Uh-huh, so that is a mounted MG, and I know we had some kind of stuff like that in campaigns. I wonder if this is like, hey, this might be a kill streak. To me, this would have to be a kill streak. This isn't gonna be a weapon. It may be, I doubt it. 
I doubt this is like a new LMG. If anything, this is gonna be like the explosive bow or the war machine is probably what this will replace. I feel like this is probably gonna be a kill streak if it gets added, and I definitely not gonna be a weapon you hold because it looks kind of insane. I didn't even get to see all those guns. To be honest, there's not a ton more information in this besides the new weapons that we're getting. So there's the crossbow. That looks like the MAC-10. Uh, this looks like the bullfrog. But what was that one in the back here? I'm just trying to see if there's any... That one looks kind of new. I'm not going to lie. That one looks different than the other ones here. Not exactly sure what that would be, but... I mean, it's too blurry. I guess it's just like a general AR. Oh, wait, no, we got a better shot of it. We got a better shot of it. Okay, yeah, it's definitely a new weapon. That's uh, it's definitely like a Galil, which uh, Galil was kind of amazing in Black Ops 1. Uh, Black Ops 2, if it did get added, it was a DLC weapon that I didn't get. Same thing, uh, Black Ops 3. Actually, I think I had it in Black Ops 4. I think everyone got it because it was introduced with the zombies thing. Uh, I don't really remember how it was in Black Ops 4, but definitely one of the goaded weapons from uh, Black Ops 1. So dang, that is three new confirmed weapons already, which is the exact amount we got last season. So I have a feeling probably going to get uh, two of these weapons on launch, one of them mid-season, just like they did it for uh, season one. But yeah, I mean, it's cool. But we once again, we got a new AR, a new SMG, and one special weapon. If that's how every season is going to be, this game's gonna be stacked with uh, ARs and SMGs because now we're up to seven ARs, seven SMGs, three snipers, three LMGs, like, uh, and three pistols. Come on, let's let's get some more pistols in here. Let's get some more LMGs. Let's get some more snipers. But uh, I I'm still happy. New weapons are new weapons. Regardless, it's cool. And then I have a feeling we'll probably get two new melee weapons, one at season's launch and one mid-season. But uh, there was rumors of a sniper. I haven't seen anything about the sniper yet. Maybe we haven't got to that part of the trailer or... Ooh, that... I guess it's a thumper. I looked at that originally. I was like, that's a ranger. Uh, you know, like the, the whatever you want to call them, the little sawed off shotguns, but I doubt it. That could be a new melee weapon. I don't know if I'm looking too much into the player model. See, at this point, I don't know. Like, okay, I got to stop looking into the small little things. That's probably not potentially, but who really cares? Dang. So uh, I don't care too much about the storylines of the seasons. I was only really here to kind of check out the um, new weapons. And from watching what I saw here, three new confirmed weapons coming next season. Uh, essentially, just like last season, new AR, new SMG, and then a, uh, a weapon from another category, which is going to be the crossbow. I'm most excited about the crossbow because I feel like it's going to change up gameplay the most. I really want to see what that crossbow is going to do upgraded. Uh, crossbows have always been kind of a special thing in zombies when upgraded. Black Ops 1 turned into kind of like a monkey bomb style thing and was used for uh, high round strategies, especially with how powerful the wonder weapons are this year in zombies. Dude, using a crossbow, if it has the same monkey bomb effect, could be so cool because it, on Firebase Z, a lot of times, I don't find myself using my secondary weapon. It's just kind of, you know, in the background. I don't really use it for anything, but being able to have like a special effect weapon like this and other stuff like that, is gonna be really freaking cool. So I am really excited to see what that crossbow can do in zombies. Uh, obviously the AR and the SMG are just gonna be like any other AR or SMG in zombies. Kinda, you know, it could be good or it could be meh, but we'll have to see about that. So yeah, that is uh, the confirmed new weapons. I know I heard a lot of rumors about a sniper, but I did not see any sort of sniper in, uh, in this gameplay. So maybe it's still coming. Who knows, but uh, yeah, I guess I'll go ahead and leave that here for you guys. What are you most excited about from this trailer? Are you excited about the Galil, the Kaparis, or the uh, the crossbow that is being added? Or are you most excited about the new melee weapon? But yeah, that's going to be it for this one, guys. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.